We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome to the Freak Show, where our one rule is get the SPF 9000. I am your host, Bumpy McSquiggums, and we're going to be starting up a multiplayer V Rising little scenario server thing that we're going to be doing. Uh, it's by Stunlock Studios, releasing originally into Steam Early Access on May 17th, 2022. And on May 17th, 2023, the Secrets of Gloom Rot uh, big update's going to be coming. So, some new content and stuff if you haven't been around for a while, and that's going to be uh, some good times. Big shout out and a thank you to V Rising for sending a code my way. Uh, well, Stunlock Studios, uh, I appreciate that. And uh, yeah, I'm going to be diving in. I'm going to kind of get my footing, kind of figure out where we're going to start and settle and all that stuff. And I believe in the next episode, we're going to bring uh, Commissar and I believe Splooch are going to join me. And we'll see if we can't get Mutana and others on board. So we'll, s we'll see how it goes. But uh, this is supposed to be a lot of fun with friends. And well, it's kind of what I want to do. So. I shall hit play. Now, we could join an online realm, begin our rise, and all that stuff, but I don't think I'm going to go that route. I think I'm going to go with a private game. We could also host a dedicated server, but then I wouldn't be able to play, so we're going to go with this. We are probably going to go PvE, and we're going to call this The Freak Show. And apparently there's standard PvE rules. That's probably fine. Clan size will go up to... I, six. I, I don't know that we would go past six. You know, maybe we'll just make it up to ten. What does this say here? The number of players that can join a single clan. Players of the clan can rise together. Uh, again, it's going to mostly be like folks that I stream with and do recordings with and things of that nature. So we may grow to a certain size at some point, but we're not really looking to get a whole bunch of folks to come and join and do all that stuff. Because we're not sure how often we're going to be able to do this. Oftentimes when we do co-op stuff, it's, you know, like once a week or once every couple weeks or so on and so forth. It gets really hard to coordinate the more people you get, essentially. So, yeah, uh, we'll throw the password in later. And I believe the, again, most concurrent players we're going to want to go with is probably going to be 10. Hello, password. That's not going to be the password. I just wanted to see if we had it all blanked out or not. We do not. All right. Uh, there are advanced game settings that are very interesting. And I don't know that I need to know any of this stuff right now, so we're going to back out of it. And we're going to begin. Initializing, starting up, and let the adventure get underway. Hey, there we are. All right, we can actually go and uh, create our caricature. I think I'm going to kind of be purpley I'm, I'm going I'm going to be purpley a little purpley I, I need some hair though oh my god what yeah that that's hair um anything okay yes is there anything screaming out at me yep absolutely eye color I can't have black oh I don't like that Kind of too bright, you know? I think I'm going to go with the green. It actually doesn't... It, do, it doesn't look that bad to me. Oh, we got... We got some beardy things. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. What the heck was that? Do we have a metal jaw? Okay. What does this mean? Oh, we could lock it to randomize if we wanted. I understand. Sure, that, that seems fine. What kind of accessories? Oh, no. Little exclamation point earrings. Sure, we have bad ears. Why not? That sounds good to me. Character name is not going to be Delmore. It's going to be Bumpy. Squiggums. Hey, I fit. Look at that. Create. Sorry, your chosen name isn't valid. You know why? Because it's probably got a space in it. Create. Or, it doesn't like the word bum. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Press space to wake up. Can I also press X for Jason? Oh. Oh. That You know, that is actually how I got out of bed in the morning. Little known fact. 
Uh, collecting the remains, the bones of the dead will come to serve a new purpose. Collect 30 bones and unlocks a bone sword recipe. Uh, oh. Interesting. Interessante. Okay, I have a little blood. Oh. Well, that was interesting. Okay. Okay. Interesting. What does what does F do? Feed ability. All right. Cool. 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 Shift to jump. Very cool. Oh, I found some bones and some lumber. Apparently, I found some bony lumber. All right. Now, like I said, the plan is to get everything set up so when. Uh, the folks are able to join we're, we'll actually not be like i don't know if we have to run through the tutorial separately or what's going on but essentially i want to get out of whatever the starting area is considered so we're able to just join up and have at it dive in have some fun you know do what we do and not be hindered uh-huh Okay, I've got half the bones that I need. I mean, there's a lot of bones on the ground. I feel like I could definitely use some of those ground bones. Hmm. I guess they're not big fans of giving me uh, gr enough ground bones. I am frailed. I don't know what that means. But I don't disagree with it. Oh, oh. oh, there's a big cooldown timer on it. I'm entering. It's time. Look at my mohawk. Look at my mohawk. You are a skeleton. Ow, you hit me and I don't like it. Oh, look at that counter. Oh, there we go. Up to 25 bones. Here, hold that. Oh, it is super laggy at times. I'm not sure. Oh, what just happened? Hey, crafting recipe unlocked. Bone sword. Slay enemies using a bone sword. Uh, okay, how do I... Tab? Crafting. Bone sword, I guess I'm making a bone sword. That works. Works for me. Alright. Oh, I just... Okay, I can equip it like that. That's interesting. I would have thought for sure that I would have like equipped it and then just had extra attacks, but that's okay. Apparently I can get plant fibers and things. And rats, I guess. Alright, that's enough of that for right now. Let's continue onward. I did enjoy the hit hit ha though. Grab the bones there, grab the bone over here, grab some plant fibers, get some more bones. And really, we just gotta slay one more guy. Using the Sword of Destiny. What doth thou think is down here? Yeah. I hath done it. I have learned that I can craft a ring of bone. And I shall do so. I have a rat. That's a little weird. I shall craft the ring of bone. Nothing shall stop me. Probably. Uh, 
to actually do anything. I thought maybe it was going to do something like explode on impact or something. Nope. It didn't do anything. Huh. Very strange. Okay, uh, I've crafted the, the bone ring. Oh, and it just auto-equipped. Cool. Uh, bone guard vestments and vermin salve. Okay, looks like we got a lot to craft. Oh, we can only do one at a time. Interesting. Apparently I don't have enough animal hide. Little known fact. Alright, well we can gather up enough stuff that this shouldn't be much of an issue. I'm assuming that's what that is. It seems to be going down a lot as opposed to up. I don't know that we're going in the right way because there's nothing going on over here. Okay, so. I can do that. I can't do that. I can't do that. I could do this. Oh, it does queue it up, too. Nice. I'm basically making a rat stew. You know, like one does. You get hungry every once in a while, you're like, ooh, rat stew. That sounds delicious. What does the rat stew do? I don't know. Alright, again, not really found a lot of animals. But to also be fair, I probably didn't go in the correct direction. Eh. So, I'm going to look around a little bit, see if I can't find myself an aminal. Like maybe a wolf or something. Not just these rats. A lot of plant fibers. Not much else, honestly. Well, I'll keep looking, I suppose. I hold that. I don't know what I, what was oh oh it was showing me the cooldown. So I'm not sure I know what to think right now as far as what we should be doing or not doing. Can we go in here? Cannot go in there yet. Any animals over here? Okay, this looks like this is back where we started from. We came in here, and then we went down this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. Well, we're going to continue forward. We're going to avoid, hopefully, uh, a little bit of the old combat. A little bit of the old combat wombat, and we'll keep moving forward. And hopefully we can find some of this animal stuff. Because, uh, I haven't seen any animals in a while. Ooh. Enter the Farbane... Woods. Okay, I, I guess. I'm on the east side, maybe it would have been smarter to go on the west side. I am not sure. This sire right here must be slaughtered. I'm sorry about your face and everything else. Huh. 
Well, not exactly the start that I was uh, looking for, but sure. We discovered the woods. Ooh, there's a shiny thing. We found the way gate. There's an animal right there. Huh. Well, there we go. We got some animal hide. Is that enough to... Yeah, it is. Uh-oh. I see you. I see you over there. I shall eat your soul. Okay, that works. And that's our final thing to craft. So we'll be able to unlock bone axes, which just sounds fun. Trees beware. You're in for bad stuff. Okay, craft some bone axes. Sure. Probably move the little rats over. Uh, yeah, bone axes on. Okay. Apparently, trees take a lot to chop down. Hope you guys were aware of this, but... Eventually, we'll get through these. Oh, there we go. Oh, I see a wolf in the back. I uh, might have uh, missed my timing window there. Okay, I can now craft a bone mace. These all seem to be pretty much identical. Minerals and okay, so this is for harvesting. It's like a, like a pickaxe. This is vegetation. This is wood. Okay, I mean that all kind of makes sense. Uh, okay. That did not work at all how I thought it would. However, we have found ourselves some delicious, delicious stone over here, which we, of course, will smack into submission eventually. There it is. A couple more to go through over here. Let's see, there's an animal over there. So it'd be nice if we uh, did this a little bit quicker, but eh, you know, sometimes you just gotta start off with a, a little bit of the dun dun, uh, dun dun uh. Sometimes that's all you really need. All right, Castle Heart and Borders. Construct and interact with a Castle Heart expander territory by placing borders, and that unlocks stuff. I don't know what any of that means right now, but okay. Hold F to teleport. Where am I going to teleport to? You cannot teleport while carrying resources. Okay. Well. Uh, crafting. Construct and interact. I summon the heart of my domain. I shall be able to build my castle. So I, I guess we look around for whatever a castle heart is? I don't, I don't know what that is or what that's going to look like. I suppose we'll find out. 
All right, guys and gals, I don't know exactly where I'm going to edit this. I've spent a very long time roaming and wandering around trying to figure out where the blood heart is, and I'm sure folks are laughing at me and telling me, you're an idiot and blah, blah, blah. So comment sections can be super fun. But I think, uh, I, I I don't know. I had some tool tips turned off. Oh, hold on. We're, we're being uh, assaulted here. It's fine. Anyway. I think I have tooltips turned off or something. I don't know. But it, it never told me how to build a blood heart thing. I assumed all crafting was done through this system. But I was going through different buttons. And oh look, we can build a castle heart anywhere that we want. As long as we have enough blood essence and uh, stone. And we, we definitely have enough. So if you guys are curious, because again, I don't know how far I'm going to drag you guys along with me. Uh, we started down here. I have wandered all the way to this spot. It, it's been a long way. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to head south. And uh, once I get south, I'm going to try to get near the teleporter. And then we're probably going to plop down our blood heart and call it a day. Because I think that's going to be essentially where our... Or maybe I'll just find a nice spot out here. But essentially where our castle is going to be. And... I think if we're too far out, it's going to just be a difficult thing to either keep track of, to get to, or what. I'm not 100% sure. But honestly, we don't have a tremendous amount of time left in the video anyway. Oh, and the sun's rising. So that, that'll be fun. So I'm going to, again, I'm going to make my way back down toward where teleportations and things are happening. And it'll probably be fine. I just follow this down. Oh, it's so far away. We have so far to go. And we can't... We can't, like, teleport from here. No. Well, that's... That's kind of inconvenient. Alright, so I think what we'll do is, well, maybe I'll move to that spot that I just marked. Oh, that's cool. Give this actual little marker. And uh, once we make it to that spot, assuming I am still alive, oh god, yeah, sunburn's real, folks. Sunburn is real. Uh, we'll probably break off. We'll we'll throw down the the thing, the blood heart, castle heart, and we will uh, build our first few borders, and that will do it for our first adventure. And then I will have our crew meet up with me for our next adventure, which I think will be fine. Uh, that'll be just fine. We just have to make it there, and we're close. And then I gotta figure out from the spot that we're going near to where we're actually gonna build out at. I think probably to the right over here. So like there might maybe some elevated ground or something there that we can make use of. I'm not entirely certain. hurts. I don't like it. I don't like it, Sam I am. I don't like it at all. Oh, I thought there was going to be some, uh... Look, oh, there is. There is elevated ground. Oh my, I thought there was going to be some elevated ground, but I'm not seeing it. That's right. Oh my god. What the heck is that? That's a man trap. Well, I mean... I guess we got some defenses. Not exactly what I thought was going to go down, but... Seems fine, probably? Alright, let's bash this thing down, and I think I'm going to build up in this area. Alright. Build there. And then I got to expand my borders by three. Okay. Oh, and then I also have to interact with the Castle Heart. Which I've done. Alright, cool, cool, cool. We did it. Walls and structures. Technology unlocked. Uh, we can place a wooden coffin, a wooden stash. We can build some palisades. I think this is a perfect spot to break off our very first episode. Again, uh, the next episode I plan to have everyone join up and uh, we'll begin... This probably won't kick off until the return from vacation. 
uh, waiting on a passport and waiting on our car to get fixed for several days. No, oh my God, that's a large bear. For several days now, and it still hasn't happened. And it looks like I'm going to have to do battle with this bear as it definitely sees me. Huh, well, this is a bit unfortunate. I have to feed the heart somehow. Oh, you're not just a any bear, you're like a super bear. I thought you were like a level 22 bear or something. You are not. friend that's kind of nearby. Oh, I don't think doing this out in the sunlight is necessarily the best call. But we did it. It's fine. Anyhow, uh, so after the vacation, when I come back, we're going to kick that off. Uh, I might try getting everybody together to do a recording beforehand, and I can upload it during the vacation, but either way, like I said, I wanted to get the foundation, not quite literally the foundation of the castle, but the foundation laid uh, Refamiliarize myself with the game. That way, I can, you know, be at a certain stage and say, "All right, everybody, come to me," so on and so forth. So uh, again, just laying the groundwork for us to actually be able to connect up and get this started whenever we're all available and ready to do it. That's gonna be great. Anyway, folks, that's it for this episode. If you want more information about the game, where to get the game, information on the developer, any of that stuff, down below in the description of the video, there'll be various links, just like there always are. And until next time, folks, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer.